Okay, we got our three lasers, and we've uh, we've uh, glued. We straightened our wires out, and then we glued the PC boards so they uh, don't touch anything, and uh, so that the wires are uh, able to be moved around and handled. Because you know, before they would break real easily if you uh, didn't glue them. So uh, we're making in, making them tougher. Okay, now um, step number twelve: strip one quarter inch or six millimeters of what you call it uh, the insulation, the plastic on the wire. Let me see. Can we see this? Maybe I should pick the camera up a little bit. Okay. There you go. Can you see that it's in there a little bit? So quarter inch, six millimeters, something like that. There we go. There we go. Kind of see that. Okay, and we do this with uh, the negative wires. Okay, and then we're going to take all of the positives. Let me see the positives. Uh, yeah, uh, back out a little bit. Okay, now uh, when we line up our lasers, we want to make sure that the blue is on that side and the po and the red is on this side. So blue on that side, red on that side, and then we're going to take all of our positives and uh twist them together yes. take our two positives right here there we go our two positives uh and uh we're, we're going to do these two positives and then we're going to put another positive from the other laser on here also they just do not want to go together it's because I'm doing this on video that they don't want to behave there we go okay yeah you can kind of see okay they're they're twisted together now I'm going to get the third laser and whatever <laughs> the third laser and get its positive and line it up with those two there we go well, let's take this thing and put okay we're uh... stupid YouTube always texting me every couple minutes okay we're uh, twisting all three of our positives together now you can see all three of our positives are together on our wires. Okay. Now, uh, yeah, we need to make sure that all the blues come out on once. Oh, man, the thing came off already. You annoying little. Okay, well, okay, I'm going to do the pause. I'm going to do the positives. I'm going to put them together, and then I want to put the blues together, and I'll show you in a second when it's done. Okay, here we go. I've got my lasers and I've got uh, all the positives wrapped together and all of the negatives wrapped together. Okay. Yeah, I should have done a better job orienting these so that uh, like the blues are on one side and the reds are on the other side, but whatever. As long as we can spread them apart like this when they're when they're uh, when they're soldered okay now uh okay hold on next next step okay we're just flying through the steps i don't know we're like on step number 16 now or something um uh, okay next thing we need to do is go back and get our uh female our female jst connector and remember we got these long wires on our female jst connector nope another thing Remember our two uh, shrink tubing, tubing, shrink tubing, tubing tubes? Okay, we're going to put them on our...
positive and on our negative on the female JST connectors and we're going to push them all the way back up to the head so that they're as far away from this when when we're um, soldering the uh, these wires geez okay focus 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 maybe if I get my hands out Hey, is it focused now? It's more focused. Yay! It's my freaking hands and making it blurry. Okay. Um, okay, we got our long wires on our male, female JST connector. And we've got our um, shrink tubing on there. And then we need to take the red from the uh, female JST connector and wire it up with the red on the uh, lasers. Yeah, see? I'll take them and wrap them around each other okay that's pretty good and then we're going to do the same thing with the negative from the female JST connector to the blue wires the, the red uh, the black wire the negative black wire from the female JST connector to the blue wires, which are the negatives for the for the lasers. We're gonna take them and yeah, there we go. Yeah, we're gonna take them and wrap them around each other. There we go. All right. Working out a little bit better. Okay, now we need to fire up our soldering iron so that we can solder these on there. And we've got to make sure that our uh, shrink tubing is still, you know, on our, you know, JST, female JST connector. And uh, it's wired up to our uh, lasers. Now we just have to solder these two and uh, do the. Uh, uh, shrink tubing hold on okay now we have sorry this isn't in very good uh, 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 focus like everything in my video I used to have a I used to have a camera where I could actually zoom in really close to really small things and it would focus really nicely and it had a manual focus uh, mode also, but uh, this uh, camera is only uh, digital focus, and it doesn't have a very close uh, focus uh, range. Okay, anyways, okay, so these are our wires from our lasers and our uh, female JST connector, and we still have our uh, shrink tubing on our female JST connector. Uh, way over here, far away from the uh, far away from these solder joints that we're about to solder because if the if the heat shrink tubing was close to the wire joints right here that we're soldering then the wire would heat up and then the the uh, uh, shrink tubing would start to heat up and start shrinking so we need to keep the shrink tubing far away from the wires no, these little solder joints that we're getting ready to solder okay okay this is good. We're gonna we're gonna finish this off in uh, video number ten. Okay, okay, yeah, getting that, getting that nice. It's all nice and nice and smooth or something. Oop, it's getting lumpy, so I'm gonna put a little bit more solder on there to make it smooth and bring it off. Okay, there we go. Bring it, there we go. Okay, I'm gonna take this. I'm gonna take the solder blob, and I'm gonna s no get out of the way, man. Come on, stop being, stop photobombing me, dude. Come on, bro. Okay, okay. I'm gonna take the solder blob, touch it to the other wire <clears throat> to heat up the wire, and then we start touching our solder to the wire. Woo! Make sure you have an open window or something and a fan in the background to try to keep these fumes away. Don't breathe these fumes, please. That's bad. It's like, uh, 
rosin and uh, and tin and lead so don't breathe of the vapor <laughs> okay uh, all right those are pretty long those wires are pretty long so I'm going to cut it down a little ways there we go and I'm gonna cut this one down a little ways there we go okay now since uh ouch i just poked myself there's a little sharp needle there on the side of this one look at that now uh, you annoying little turd okay uh, there we go okay <coughs> okay uh yeah now i'm going to take this little nub right here that's sticking up you can kind of see that little nub sticking up right there and then I'm gonna kind of try to bend it over towards uh, these wires. There we go. Okay. And I'm gonna do the same thing with the red, with the one with the little nub on the red wires. I'm, uh, I'm going to bend it over towards the red wires. And so that's kind of hard. You might want to use your uh, pair of pliers to do this part. Okay, now we're going to take our uh, uh, heat shrink tubing. Well, we're just going to take one of the heat shrink tubings. We're going to leave it way, the other one way down here. We're just going to do one right now. So uh, I'm doing, what's that? That's the black one. Okay, I'm putting it on over the, over the solder connection. You can see the solder connection. And what you don't want to do is, like, here's your lasers. You don't want to put it really far up on your lasers because then all your wires are together and you can't move your lasers apart from each other when you're trying to put them inside your thing. So you want to have your heat shrink tubing just a little bit past where the solder joint is. Yeah, there we go, just a little bit. Okay, so, so it leaves these wires to the lasers, you know, pretty long or as, almost as long as they can be because they're really small, short lasers okay and we're gonna all right all right and we shrink the shrink tubing and uh that looks uh really nice yeah move it back here maybe you can see it there okay shrink tubing looks pretty good now we're going to take the shrink tubing from the other side on the red wire and we're going to push it up just a little bit past the little uh nub the solder nub you know pretty much even with the the pretty much even with the uh the shrink tubing on the blue wires okay I'm take these two and separate them a little bit all right and there we go all right Okay, okay, and uh, these uh, heat shrink tubing usually holds on to heat for a long time, so, you know, let it cool off for a little while, but anyways, there we go, we've got our uh, lasers uh, soldered up, and our female JST connector, and we're going to plug in our battery to our, uh, to our connector and turn on the water turn on the switch and take the male JST connector and make sure the reds on that side and the blacks on that side red and black okay and plug them in and there you go you got uh, three working laser diodes there we go you see that? Uh, I didn't do a very good job checking my lasers. You see there's remnants and like fuzzy stuff and shit. So uh, yeah, you need to check your lasers for that in the first place. I did a bad job. I was just in a hurry. But we have one more video to go and then we'll be done. Okay. Bye. Thanks.